and we're back making another episode because I can't leave to save the game. You know, there's no time to go walk around inside. I need to go to the castle, so I gotta go to the castle. I, I'm, I'm forbidden to leave. I gotta go to the castle, so let's go to the castle. Anyway, so uh, yeah, it was, it was it was really yeah. So basically, this is where things get uh, again get interesting and crazy again because basically you have this giant wave of water messing around. And I'm thinking, oh, at first, okay. Are we kind of participants may register on the registration disc within the area now? Okay, go. Basically, what you do, the same stuff. You know, please follow the way to your left. All right. Everyone's left to the island arena. No fear. I wanted to watch. Look at this dude. Oh, it was a castle with a block. Got the duration of the contest. All right. Well, I went before the contest. Yeah, there's just so much work to do with the contest. Anyway. So I'm going to be yeah, so basically you have this giant wave of water about to come in. I was thinking, hey, you know, what they're gonna do is they're on the boat trying to figure out what they need they need to do. And they see they see there's a, a tsunami coming. So they're like, okay, get let's get out, you know, get away from where the tsunami's gonna come and you know, walk, you know, basically wash everybody away and it's not good. So we gotta, we gotta get out of the way. So I was like, you know, okay, cool, they're gonna get out of the way. But it's like, no, we're we're gonna ride the wave. Yeah, we'll ride the tsunami way. I'm like, oh, that's that's really stupid. And you know, then you see, of course, why it's stupid because basically they are trying to go up. You know, it's the the sea their CG boat. They're in their CG boat. You're in the goddess, aren't you? You better hurry up or you'll miss their registration. They're in a CG boat. Um, going up a CG wave. Goddess looks like it'll be a lot of fun. You know. I get a feeling that the fighters are a lot tougher than usual. Good. See you, contest. Uh, you're a contestant. Please go to the registration desk and sign you up. Uh, sign up. Right. And they're doing this thing, and they're trying to basically get up this, get over this wave before, uh, get over this wave, you know, that of water that's going up. And then you see like other boats start to basically, get, you know, try to do the same exact thing and fail. And basically, the wave gets so high and so steep that some of these boats are flopping over and, you know, you know basically, you know, like flopping over and the passengers obviously are dying or being, uh, basically, are, are, are trying to make it. And I'm like, man, that's some bull crap. You know, it's a random boat you got from the dock it's just trying to stay alive in. You know, you know, why are you here? Why, why aren't you, you know, somewhere far away from where the the things the tsunami's gonna be? And I'm like, ugh, this is bad. But of course, the tsunami also brings a um cargo ship over, a big old giant cargo ship. Excuse me, I'm participating in the tournament, and uh, the guy who played Mr. Fantastic is on the Brooklyn Bridge, and the cargo ship, you know, basically is uh, brought over by the wave. To where uh, your name, mm. the uh, Claude C. Kinney, where the uh, car, you know, like where the, these uh, brought up to where the Brooklyn Bridge is, and there's all these um, you know truck and train containers, you know, on there, freight train freight containers on there, and one of them falls onto the Brooklyn Bridge and smashes uh, the uh, smashes the guy that played Mr. Fantastic. You know, and then uh, the rest of the ship falls onto the bridge and destroys it. And I'm like, yeah, <laughs> that's what you get. And I'm like, yeah, hey, no, no more. Let, we have less unpleasant scenes now because he's gone. Mm, yeah, we did. And so, Kitty, oh, yes, first of all, please give me all your weapons and items. We give them here for you. Mm. Okay. All right, now I'll give you the equipment sent to you to us by your sponsoring weapons shop. No, no, no. You will receive the you know, stuff for the area for details. For now, you all, you are all set. Place, you know, please relax in the waiting room until the tournament begins. Thank you. And there's the yeah, so. Excuse me. Has my weapon arrived yet? Mm. Yeah, you look a little weird, but that's okay. I can live with it. You're a DS flag, right? I'm sorry. We haven't received anything, anything from your weapon shop. How much do I, time do I have? Hmm. Well, given the circumstances, we'll extend the deadline to just before the start of your first match. Would you participate? Perhaps you able to visit the weapons shop to see what the situation is? I don't intend, need you to remind me. Hmm. Death. Rita, what do you want? Hmm. 
Is Gamgee's weapon here yet? <sighs> What's it to you? Mm -hmm. He never say a yeah. He never would say yeah. Mm -hmm. That's weird. Mm -hmm. What's it to you? Mm -hmm. Everything. I'm the one who introduced you to him. Mm -hmm. Dun dun dun. <laughs> introduced him. What is all of this all about, Rita? Ah, mm -hmm. uh, crap. Mm -hmm. It's nothing. She was just the right place in the right place at the right time. Nothing to get jealous over, Claude. Mm. What? Stop thinking about it. It's my problem, not yours. I'm sorry. I need to go with Deus. I need to go, go with Deus for a moment. Rita? Deus can't fight in the tournament without a weapon. You don't want to lose your chance to fight him, do you? What are you waiting for? Go, go over me. It's not even me. It's that much to you. <laughs> God, it's not like that. <sighs> well, you're the one picking out weapons for Deus. Who side are you on anyway? <laughs> so good. Uh, God, why are you saying this? What do you think, Rita? <laughs> I'm out of here. Make this crap. <laughs> Probably could have handled that better, Claude. I was just like two kids arguing just now. What did I do? It would seem you have no idea how simple it is to hurt a girl's feelings. Especially when that girl is trying to keep secrets from you. <laughs> In an effort to kind of help you with something, but also be with the person, with a dude she may actually really like want to be with and stuff. It's really it's really weird. <laughs> it's really complicated. Uh she's probably should have just told you about it or something. I, I don't know. You don't have to rag on me like this. Sheesh. Or Julia and ragging on Rita though? Ouch. Oh jeez. Like oh Yeah, back in. <laughs> Dang it. Thank you, room for contaminators only. Research is only registered. allowed in. I'm going in. I'm sorry, but the contest is about to start. Please wait in here. The guys in here all have their own reasons for entering. Me, I just like fighting against strong guys. What may you decide, you know? To prove myself. That's why. My weapon shop hired me to enter the tournament. That means I'll get twice as much money when I win. Don't disturb me. I'm doing some self image training. Mm. Uh, I'm imagining the battle mm. going through it in my head. I can't afford to lose the contest. I've got five kids to feed. Mm. Gentlemen, the like, Gorge Hardness is now officially underway. My first match of the first round is about to begin. Please come up to me when your name is called. Amun Rao, fighting for the straight shape jab. Sweet, I'm first. Let's do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Claude Kinney, from the loyal, fighting for the knockout. Uh, here. Not controlling that. You just walk in. Wow, you're already on the field. Hang in there, Claude. Don't fizzle out on me. Thanks, I'll try my best. Where's the save point? Now, I'll be handing you the items you're allowed to use during metal. Remember, these are going to be the only items you'll have for the use of the entire tournament. Sweet syrup. Two sweet syrup acquired. Mixed syrup acquired. Blackberries acquired. The rules are simple. People, no people, the two participants who are uh, uh, participants into the arena and stuff like that. Please, uh, one loses. Uh, everyone, please remember that being retrofied or paralyzed will also cause a loss. This is your last chance to check up on your equipment. Folks, do you have everything you need? I got the equipment. See you guys next time. No, I, oh, not yet. We're good. Far color, leather, armor, shield. Yeah, yeah, we're good. Are you ready for that arena? Yes. Let's go. Anyway. So, see you guys next time. Check me out on YouTube. Mm -hmm.